south of the border and uh, we're gonna deliver the panel truck to the guy in um, South Carolina. Funny story is that uh, we bought different truck from his friend and his friend told him like hey there's a guy upstate that's coming down to pick up the truck he found this and asked me to go pick it up so I mean everything worked out pretty good so um, but he bought it on scene so uh, we're gonna see what he uh, what he thinks about it and hopefully he thinks that we did a good job all right I just want to see your face when you see it. <laughs> How are you? Good. Good. Cadillac is this one right here? Yeah, Catalina, that's a problem. See, right on the lip. I still look good. How are you guys? It's about to be for sale. Everybody's selling my truck and it's not there. You know that? We did have mom's bus too. So what's the price? <laughs> you know? Depends where it's going. Oh, okay. Gotcha. <laughs> yeah. S10 frame, LS swap, AC. and everything else underneath the suspension you can buy from a local part store. Benefit with S10. But, um, all right, well, thank you. Yes, sir, appreciate nice, it. Nice, right. nice seeing you. Well, that worked out really good. Um, now we're gonna go to his friend, the truck that we bought. Well, not we, but we uh, bought it for a customer, so that's the next project. You gotta tell me the story about it. Oh man, you want to know the story. So uh, I worked with a guy and uh, his dad, I guess, got into it and didn't wanna, didn't wanna do anything with it. He got it, somebody before him swapped it with a small block and a bunch of unnecessary JC Whitney parts. And when I got it from him, it was a small block basket case with a 62 running gear and everything like that, just stopped. And uh, I started working from there. I rode with so, it with a, a small block in it for a year or so, and then I got tired of the small block, sold the small block, built the LS, sold that, acquired a bunch of other parts for an LS, and then I took all that shit and put it in the cop car right there. <laughs> and then uh, that's a beast right there. And then uh, I was like, well, section it in, uh, putting a, um, a notch in it so it'd lay the frame. So I just kind of came up with some dumb shit like this. So I, I, I screwed some wood in through here and then I built on the back wall over here, you can't see it. There's a piece of uh, uh, stained oak on the back side. And basically it was a sliding bed. So you can open this up. And in the back is in the same position. And the way it has the back is the way I'm gonna do the front. And the cheap ass on, on board air was I run it through here and use it as a license plate bolt. Yeah, you ready to say goodbye, you little baby? Alright, long story short, about the 1962 pickup truck we uh, we just picked up, um, found in the marketplace, 
there was already a lot of people all over it and uh, we were the first people to uh, put a deposit on it um, looks badass super clean has a very cool patina to it we're gonna finish it and uh, then it's going to Sweden um, that wraps up this video tomorrow we're gonna look at a Humvee but that's a different story See you down.